Yeah, I think we did one tilt a world too many. Hey, 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 hey. Keep it down or I'm gonna turn the hose on a bunch of you. <laughs> I want a big rodent. I'm not cute up a corn dog. Come on, you two. Let's get ready for bed. Night. Night. I am to kiss you good night. Night, night, mom. See you all. Night, guys. Boy, they're great kids. Yeah, they are. <laughs> It was so sweet of you to invite them. You know, most men wouldn't do that on a first date. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't mind if they come along on our second date. Our second date? Yeah, I had a great time. But didn't you? Oh, sure, sure. But you know, with, with the kids along, we didn't have much chance to talk, you know, date talk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and maybe tomorrow we should leave Abby and Lucas at home. Tomorrow? Too soon to get a sitter? No, no, tomorrow would be fine. <laughs> uh, w would, would you care to come in for a minute? Oh, better not. You know, the kids are just settling down. Oh, right. The kids. Yeah. Well, good night. Good night. I'll just say it. I think I'm starting to be attracted to you. <laughs> Very funny. You okay, Matt? My lips, very dry. You had fun, huh? Well, you know, that depends on what you call fun. If it's never being more than an inch away from a beautiful woman with an amazing attitude, then... Yeah, it was pleasant. What's her name? Kelly. Barnes. Barber. Barga Berber Nugan Inderbins. Barga Berber Nugan Indemins? You don't even know her last name. Hey, it was only our first date. You were kissing. Well, it's still legal in this state last time I checked. So how was your date? Oh, fine. We took Abby and Lucas to the county fair. You took Abby and Lucas on your date? So there wasn't a lot of kissing. At least I know his last name. Hey, I know stuff about Kelly. Like she's a freelance writer and a part-time model. Guess which one pays the rent? <laughs> Spare me the details. So, like, um, where'd you go? To the beach. The beach? Yeah, we drove by it, strolled along it, waded into it, and then tossed pennies and made a wish. Did it come true? Almost. <laughs> Till that big wave rolled in. <laughs> Speaking of which, anything roll over you and old Martin? Well, it was just our first date. You know, it takes time to get to know a person. You know, I find one long kiss tells me all I need to know. Hmm. I remember those days. Hmm. Clearly. <laughs> Whoa, two dates in two nights? Aren't you worried about your reputation? <laughs> okay, out with it. What's wrong? Why would anything be wrong? Well, there's no pile of dresses on the bed. Well, when you're excited, really excited about a date, this place is a pigsty. <laughs> I'm still excited. Martin likes the kids. The kids like Martin. He's polite. He's a hard worker. And I'm just sure he's dependable. Mm, so is your Volvo, and it has an airbag. <laughs> okay, so maybe Martin would rather go to Disneyland than Paris. That doesn't mean I can't be attracted to him. Well, then what is the reason you're not attracted to him? I didn't say I wasn't attracted to him. Well, you don't have to say you're not attracted to him. Look, I'm not Matt, okay? I'm not some 22-year-old who's chasing anything that shakes. Uh, come on. Disneyland or Paris? Huh? Well, Disneyland or Paris, where would you rather go? Does it matter? If you could see the look on your face right now, you'd know it does. What do you want? 
what I want seems so selfish. <laughs> yeah, it is selfish. But what the Sam Hill's wrong with a little of that? Oh, Mom, don't tell me that when you first met Daddy, you didn't project how great he'd be with us kids. Well, maybe. But if Daddy hadn't made my toes curl, you kids would never have gotten here to be great with. <laughs> about time you did. Oh, honey, don't you owe yourself a, a guy who wants to tango in the moonlight with you? Do you still look for a little tango in your life? Remember that little church retreat I went to with Leo last month? Yeah. It wasn't a church and I didn't retreat. <laughs> shower and a shave and she looks right nice <laughs> you too romeo you headed off to the beach with kelly what's her name again <laughs> yep and this time i'm prepared my buns may be used as a flotation device <laughs> matt do you think this time we could actually meet your friend oh i don't know you know she's kind of shy <laughs> <laughs> shy Hi, Martin. Come on in. Here you go, Lucas. Catch. Oh, sure. Now you drop it. <laughs> what does it all scribble on? It's autographed by the Rams. Wow! Give me that. No way! Abby, the latest CD from Pearl Jam. Oh, cool. Give me that. No way! You're Mrs. Bailey, the new Danielle Steele. Oh, I can't wait to see who gets naked in this one. Give me that. Wait your turn. <laughs> I'm sorry, Matt. I wasn't sure what you liked. It's okay. So I, I took a shot at King's tickets. Do you like hockey? I do, I do, I do! Oh, Matt, I hear it's low tide. Say, have you ever been kissed in front of 18,000 screaming fans? It was a long time ago and I needed the money. <laughs> I'm sorry, what was the question? I don't know, but this is usually the answer. Vanessa? Uh huh? These are for you. Oh. <laughs> you know, we should scatter them on the floor and dance the tango. Do they keep longer in a vase? <laughs> they sure do. I think you're going to like the restaurant I picked. Is it dark and romantic? Better. It has a 122-item salad bar. Of course. Oh, Vanessa. Oh, isn't it an extraordinary night? You noticed? You bet. Well, meteorologically speaking, it's a high-pressure front. I dabble in weather. Oh. <laughs> Martin? You like Disneyland, right? Well, it is the happiest place on Earth. <laughs> Why? Do you like Paris? I've never gone, but I'd really like to. You would? Yeah. I heard they built Euro Disney right outside. <laughs> Martin? Yeah? What was that for? It's true. You, you can learn a lot from a kiss. Martin, I want Paris. Ah, heck, I need Paris. <laughs> We're not talking Euro Disney here, are we? I'm sorry. No, oh, don't be. I appreciate your honesty. Well, I owed you the... I owed both of us the truth. Do you still feel like dinner? Oh, yeah. I could use the roughage. <laughs> so, um, how's your dog, Cosmo? Um, my turn for honesty. Uh, Cosmo uh -huh. isn't mine. 
I barred him to attract women. I know, I know. <laughs> you believe that at my age? No, no. <laughs> so, how's your dog? Oh, she's dead. <laughs> continues right after this. <laughs> Come on, Julie, you gotta move. You gotta rub up against somebody or cough up a hairball, something. I'm begging here. Walter, you got a uh, cat on a leash there. It's the unusual that sets me apart. <laughs> hey, what are you doing back here? You got someone. Ah, it didn't work out. Why? She doesn't like hockey. You gave up on a beautiful, biologically accommodating woman because she doesn't like hockey? <laughs> hey, Walter, even I have some standards. Like, uh, what else? Actually, just the hockey one. <laughs> wait, wait, wait a second. I don't get it. You hang out with me and I hate hockey. Oh, jeez. Wish you hadn't told me that. 